Hi, and welcome to another two-minute tutorial from USMLE RX. Today we are going to look at the advanced test creation settings within QMAX. So to do that, we're going to go to our dashboard, and from our dashboard we will uh, open up our menu and go down to QMAX, where we'll choose Create Test. Now, by default, you're going to see our classic uh, test creation menu where you can choose uh, by discipline or by organ system. Uh, but for today, we're going to look at the Advanced tab, which will allow you to uh, uh, specify what you want to focus on. So perhaps you are studying asthma right now. So I will enter asthma as my term, and I'll see that I've got 100 uh, questions that are available to me. If I look in the left-hand menu, uh, I can actually see them broken down by category. So I can see all of the items that are tied to pharmacology, immunology, pathophysiology, uh, and so on. Uh, but perhaps I'm in a pulmonary block. So I am going to choose pulmonary, and I'm going to see that I've got 48 asthma-related items. But here's the, the one of the neat things. Um, I can actually get uh, even more specific. So maybe I want uh, asthma-related items that also uh, focus on the lungs, and maybe I want to even look at the respiratory tract. So now I have items that contain all three of those concepts um, in uh, the questions. Now, uh, if I feel like, well, I've, I've, I think I've narrowed it down too much, maybe I will deselect respiratory tract uh, and now I can I can see that I've got 33 items available to me. I say, well, I, I think I'm ready to uh, to build my test. So I can go to my test settings, uh, ensure that I'm drawing from the correct QBank, and that the test mode is right. I'm going to go to tutor mode, um, that the difficulty level is appropriate, and that uh, I'm only using unused questions. If that looks good, I will go to the uh, start test button in the lower right hand corner and I will choose a test name and maybe I don't have time for 33 items right now so what I'm going to do is adjust my slider down to 10 items from here I can click begin test it's that easy thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe so that you can be notified when new two-minute tutorials become available Bye for now.